Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is episode 21 of my Seven Days to Die Alpha 20 Let's Play. And in today's episode, we're going to try and finish up this trench. I know it's boring, uh, but that's what you got to do sometimes. You got to do got to do the boring stuff uh, sometime uh, and I don't know it just kind of works out this way um, I don't I prefer to do videos like this where I just it's un Uncut, unedited, raw <laughs> material, straight from the source, you know, not filtered. Um, I don't know. That's the way I prefer my YouTube. I kind of get a little bit uh, annoyed when some of my favorite YouTubers edit their gameplay and I'm like, you know, that's footage I could have seen, uh, bloopers and stuff that could have been entertainment for me, <laughs> but I don't get that choice because it's like, uh, you don't want to see this. Um, I don't know if that's just my opinion, but Anyway, just let me know in the comments if you agree or disagree about, you know, editing. Uh, I find it very, I don't know, tedious to have to go through the footage to put out a two second blank space. <laughs> you know, in the video. Uh, I don't know. Uh, but I'm having a good time. <laughs> I'm really enjoying... Um, oh my goodness. I gotta eat again. My food is right there. Uh, and I gotta go up the other way. Let me do this. I think one second. Whoa. Oh, I missed. Oh, I think he fell. He's a dire wolf. Holy shizoli, I did not know that. Oh, but at least you got dinner out of it. That's good, because, you know, I was really hungry. We got 28 out of him. But we only got 25 for dogs. But the, the corpse was damaged a little. I think I shot him a couple of times. Food. Food. Uh, we're probably going to need to get some more food going too. I really don't like to cook without eggs. Didn't we get eggs last time? I thought we got some eggs. Oh, I know what happened to them. They're still in the bike. I never got stuff out of the bike. I took what I could, but it was only a couple of items. Uh -huh. There we go. And we got the ergonomic grip schematic. Or not the schematic, the mod. So, 
Keep going there. We got more meat. Yeah. Yeah, I, you know, I think I'll put that in parts. Can't really use the chain. That only goes in a club. But I do definitely like to see that ergonomic mod in my pit. Because uh, that reduces stamina usage. Yeah. Ooh, that might be something to put in my hammer if I didn't already have that in there. All right, let's make up our bacon and eggs. Our one bacon and eggs. And then um, let's get like another in. Hate, hate making grilled meat because I know the bacon and eggs is better, but we're not having a problem with finding meat. Okay, man, did not get filled up on five of those. Oh, I'm going to need more. There we go. I'm getting kind of low on my 762 ammo as well. I guess we haven't really uh, we haven't really been um, looting that much to get the ammo and we had that big dog horde come through. Uh, so, yikes. <laughs> My cat, she's playing with her little boy on her kitty condo, and it's got a little bell on it. So, if you hear a little tinkling bell, where it's from. And I definitely, definitely want to get this stuff, get this trench dug out, get those ramps dug out so that they can get back out of the trench if they want. Uh, and I kind of like that our ramps are going to be even closer to the stairs going up. Uh, over here so it's it's gonna they're gonna be able to come up and then just immediately go back up here so i really like how that worked out it's don't know it's gonna it's taken so much time to uh do all this mining. Hopefully that will help. Um, I definitely get this guy. So, yeah, I think if I get this trench, I definitely want the trench dug out completely. Oh my goodness! Oh my god! Oh, he broke my arm, gave me a fatigue, broke my leg, and a deep blast. Or, or, oh wait. In like no time. Sprained arm, mild infection, deep lacerations, fatigue, sprained leg. Okay, so we didn't break my leg and my arm. It's... Uh... Not good. Um, one thing that I do know. That normally when animals spawn... A lot of the time, they'll spawn in groups of three. And this is the second 
uh, dire wolf. So what I'm gonna do that gave us 35. I'm gonna come up here and have a look around and see. See if I can see. Oh, there's a bear. Yep, that's the third one. Oh, mommy. Holy kazooly. I knew there was going to be another animal somewhere nearby. Uh, that just ate through even more of our 762 ammo. But the area should be a lot safer now. And I'm going to try and go uh, get some first aid in there because we had 26 26 health. I know and I think need safety All right. got some food so. Another step, so we're gonna have so much. We got uh, this is so good. Um, first aid, okay. We got, uh, I think I might use this plaster cast. Oh, it's not broken though. Yeah, it's not broken. That That is horrible. I just have to deal with the sprain then, okay. Um, the laceration needs a first aid kit or sewing kit. I would really like to not use a first aid or a sewing kit. So I'm going to use this first aid kit. Okay, and honey for the infection. All right. So, oh, and we got we got fatigue, didn't we? Fatigue. We got a vitamin. And we got a few of them, so and that gets us a little bit more health. Okay, we got a repair. Awesome. All right, <laughs> we did not get near as much stuff done as I wanted to. All right. Oh yeah, clearing out this section. At least it's a little bit lit up over here. Oh, yeah, I don't, I still have the gamma turned up to 75. So that's why it's a little bit brighter. Once I get the headlamp, I'll turn it back down to 50 because it won't matter then. This will have a headlamp. All right. Uh, let's get this section done. I wonder if I should go layer by layer or just uh, that way this front part will be done. Yeah, because uh, I definitely want the front part done. 
if the front part's done, I can at least go in and swing at the zombies when they come down. Even if the other area of the trench didn't get um, taken care of. I still would like to get a, a, a way to get in and out easily. I just don't know which way I should go. Uh, underground or over the top. It'd be way easier to just build a pillar, put some ladders on it, hold it a day. Uh, and then make a walkway over. But, you know, where's the fun in that? <laughs> uh -oh. It would definitely be much more difficult to dig a tunnel out and uh, but that would be a much safer, more secure way of getting in and out. But in order to do that, I need to have, uh, you know, the main area that I'm going to be in dug out. Uh, so I might just have to deal with a temporary solution until we get our area dug out and I actually have some place to dig too. Yeah. Okay, and I'll put the shoe down so we can get up like this and get in and out. I think we can get at least this front part done today. <laughs> and that ergonomic grip is helping so much. Look at our stamina. Um, it's going right back up. This is great. Oh, yeah. That, that, that mod made such a huge difference. Yes, I'm so glad that that is something that we got out of that mission that was awesome. Because that will definitely speed up this process because we won't have to stop all the time and regain our state. Oh yeah. And then um, once we get the front part done, because uh, I think that's the way they're going to sort of default to, uh, because of, that's where I have the access points at. Uh oh. I need this one now. It's so hard to tell sometimes. Oh, hurt my hurt my leg. And I definitely want to get um, those ramps in so that they can they can get out. Okay. Well, that and so I can get out too easily. We are going to have so much stone. Oh, now that my hunger is going down, it looks like our 
uh, stamina regen isn't quite as good. It looks like we're actually uh, using quite a bit of stamina now. Now I want to go get the uh, the hammer and the frames. Got got to grab those hammer. All or... yeah, look at. We've used so many of those, and we still got 361 left. Um, I definitely want to get this part get out. So I need to knock this section down. If I could at least get one set of stairs, that would be swept. Just so I can, you know, have it laid out. Yeah. Oh, and I'm thirsty too. Should have eaten and drank while I was in there. Now we're gonna have. Okay. Now I should be able to put in stairs there's this one that's what i want right there and then This one down. Oh boy. Um, so I'm like working on my uh, recording setting or recording setup. I'm thinking about. I would love to be able to. Uh, record videos of something that's not on the computer screen and right now I don't don't have I don't even have like a webcam so um, can't can't really do that so I was uh, you know, just wondering do I want to get just a simple webcam or just to get me started or try to get a really nice camera. Yeah. Well, that's what it looks like. I need to repair this one. We got another 6,000 stone. Oh, that is so crazy. Oh, bunny rabbit. Oh, you ran off. Okay, let's, uh, we're going to have to tear this down. It's a little bit closer than what I'd like. Oh, this is only too wide. Oh, why didn't I make it? Well, I put three wide over here. It 
it is kind of close over here. Maybe I'll go back to too wide. Uh oh. I hate it when I run and sprint and then go, oh, I can't swing. I'm out of stamina. And we can just put like normal frames here to fill this in. Oh, Quit whining all the time. I'm hungry. I'm thirsty. Yeah, I don't think it lasts long enough. And my leg just will not get better. Is that an actual break now? Did I, did I get it broke? No, it won't. Oh man, so oh, thirsty. I can't wait until I can make uh, the purified water uh, because it takes a lot less amount of drinking. Um, nom, 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 nom. Okay, let's save a couple for later. <laughs> See if we can get, uh, get this stuff figured out. So, yeah, I dug this out three wide. I remember because I was digging out around it to knock it down. So that's why it was it was three wide. I accidentally made it three wide. And I want this all to be filled in and upgraded anyway, all around the edges. So this is this is okay to do that. And see we got this part dug mostly as well. And let's finish it up here. Boom. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to get that one. Oh, I probably should not be focusing on this. And then this one. Figure if I get this the entryways and this front part done, that's going to be like the majority of what I've done. And the rest is just uh, extra, I guess. Hopefully I can get this stairway done today. Okay, let's get the stairs. Go. Oh, this is so full. Oh, 
we can do it. And we're doing much better on our stamina now that we're not starving anymore. Um, need to check and see how many points I need exactly to get the, uh, the workbench. Definitely gonna want that ammo and to make our iron armor. The workbench is good for lots of other things as well. I wasn't really wanting to go too far in to the entry though. But I feel like getting to int four, getting the um, the cement mixer, the workbench, chemistry station, getting a mini bike. Those are just basic things that you should just have. <laughs> Everybody should just have. Um, I don't know. I don't think you should have to spec into that. Or I don't know. I don't think it should be I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. It's like um it's just a basic thing <laughs> that you should just have. It's, it's really frustrating to be going into going into your perk tree and then going, oh, well, I, I want to do this, but I can't because I need to work to progress. And, and I have to have to spend points getting the workbench. That's kind of poopy. Uh, like, and, and even the board. That's such a basic thing that you know, I don't think that should have to be studied. Maybe to learn steel, you know, make that where you have to, to put points into it for sure. Uh, and I really like that they have the ability to get steel in the entry uh, because before there wasn't that often if you just if you didn't get the steel drop uh, you just didn't get it uh, so it's nice to have the ability to learn it uh, but it's all the way at it in the very last uh, progression in it so you have to go all in it in order to get yeah, for sure. So, I don't know. I mean, you can, you can get it, you can get all the stuff from, but then again, you might not. <laughs> so, who knows? Oh, it's, I just looked up, it's almost 10 o'clock. Uh, I was hoping I would have gotten way more of this done, uh, but we did get the front part dug out, um, so that's good. I just, I don't think I'm going to have this stuff done 
by day 14 and have spikes to put out. I mean, how much wood do I have? Oh, I have 3,600. That's pretty nice. But I don't think, <laughs> I still don't think that's going to be enough. Uh, let's finish up this row. And um, what I'm going to do is we're going to go ahead and call the episode here. Uh, we'll pick up this is day 12. We only have two more days to finish this off. Um, oh, this is a lot of work, but I think it would definitely be worth it in the end. <laughs> um, Yeah. Normally I have my cage sitting at ground level, not underground. So this is kind of <laughs> kind of new. I'm not sure exactly how long things would take or anything because I've never built a base like this before. So yeah, let's stick around and see how it goes. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye!